Hey, Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. This is for what's going on right now. You don't see me because I want to focus more on my intuition. Okay? So let's see what's going on for you. Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, please. Full keeps trying to come out for everyone. People are ending shit. Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What's going on right now, please, sir? Daughter of Cups, which is Page of Cups. And the star. The star comes after the tower. Focus on the path that you're supposed to be on. Okay? It's sm it's a small endeavor right now, but this leads this leads to the path. Okay, this could be you getting a very small offer to step into the light. Okay, but this is hope, healing, faith, renewal, giving to yourself, giving to a situation. We have the Two of Swords, the High Priestess, Death. Death keeps showing up too. And the Eight of Wands in reverse. All right. So these cards, clarity is in the middle. That's the sun being covered by an eclipse. I don't know if you noticed that. Truths were being hidden from you, and that's why you put the blindfold on to fill them out with your intuition. Okay, Your intuition was telling you that a change was coming. This to me is Pisces Taurus. Okay, because the high priestess is a sister of the empress. They're linked. All right. So this is trying to see which one weighs out. Which one do you feel the most? Okay, because this is all about the feeling. About a choice. About a way to go. What needs to be ended and what needs um, your attention, your, your energy. Okay, this could come at night. Really sitting and 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 weighing these options out, weighing this decision out. Okay, eventually the swords are going to get heavy, and the eclipse is going to move. It's like you're waiting for that eclipse to move for that big epiphany. Epiphany. We have two, two. It's choices, mulling them over. Where to put your energy? Not communicating your ending. You're ending some kind of communication, ending some kind of internet endeavor uh, or travel. There's, there's end of what that's kind of what's going on for everyone right now, but there's end to this. No more. I'm not going to communicate. I'm not giving more energy. It was a lightning strike, right? Sudden. This is the phoenix rising from the ashes. It takes time to heal. You're going to give your time to that healing yourself your creative endeavors showing your light give me more please for Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus It's like filling your way out of the darkness. A little bit of light. But you've been filling which way? Okay, one of those swords is getting heavy. We have the five of swords that just flipped out. That is, I just got chills down my body. That is separating your heart from your mind. Trying to take that sort of truth, right? You're searching for the truth of the situation. Hmm. Give me more, please, for Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. Yeah, you don't you don't want to be in your head anymore. You don't want to be in your heart. You want to make the best logical choice for you. That's why there's some there's an ending. You're ending the choices. You're just gonna focus on yourself. 
We have the Hermit. The Seven of Wands. The Hierophant. The Spiritual. Like you're okay with this. You've come to terms with this. With this ending to a relationship, ending to travel. Really focusing on your endeavors and your passions. Given to that, like, there's a lot of endings on these readings tonight. But this is like, not listening to other people anymore. Trying to cause conflict in your heart and in your mind. You know you have the key to the answer, to the knowledge that you're seeking. This is spiritual. Okay. You know you don't need a whole lot of light to find this. Yet again, we have this lightning strike here. You have the key. I just got butterflies in my stomach. It is a release. Okay. This is a release. So you can really work on yourself and figure out what path you need to go and you already know. Okay. Tell me more, please. Very intelligent. People come to you and someone has been trying to cause conflict with you, making you doubt yourself and that's why you're like, you know what? We don't need to communicate anymore. I'm not going to work with you. We don't need to communicate anymore. Totally just done with it. And it's going to focus on your dreams. Like you don't need someone telling you about your intuition. They made you feel very confused and blocked. And that is being released. Like you don't need to hear their input. You're taking like a bold step. Shh, this is kind of, the tower is literally, death into the tower has literally come out in every reading I've done so far for fire signs and water signs. So you're now the third one. People are ending shit. Two of Pentacles is in reverse, right? This is, this is no longer flipping this around and, and, and being inconsistent with this choice. This is, fast. Like it was just a feeling that you knew that you had to make this choice now. No longer delib deliberate. I can't talk. <laughs> like, you know, change had to come and you had to be the one that forcefully done it. Or someone could have done this to you. Like, you're like, you know what? That's, that's the whole energy tonight. I want change and you're blocking that. It fell out the world, right? Endings and beginnings, right? Um, this could also be being in the public eye again, really changing your outcome, knowing where you need to put your focus, following your intuition and your logic and filling this out for you. This is no one else's decision, right? They've had you stuck in your head and your heart. And that's why you've been waiting and waiting and waiting for this answer that never came. So you're like, I'm done. I'm done. I'm doing this for me. This is the uh, King of Wands, right? Very confident in your decision to do so. Again, we have a lightning strike. Sudden. Sudden epiphany. Sudden action. Sudden uh, recognition. That's what I'm feeling here. We have the five of cups and the six of cups. So this could be you that uh, cutting off a, a relationship or someone that you've known for a long time. You could just be mourning the loss of a friend or a friend mourning the loss of you or even a relationship. Like because you're you're done 
with the, the bickering. You're done. You're sad. Someone's sad about this. Give me more for Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo, please. I feel this is more recognition of something that you've been waiting on. Riding the wave, compass, and cleaning house. Balancing act at the bottom of the deck. Balancing act is really trying to get your things in order. That's number 11. You're really trying to get rid of things that are no longer serving you and keeping you stuck. This is cleaning house. This is decluttering during this time. Right? Again, putting energy of where you know you need to put it. Compass is knowing what you need to clear out. Okay? This is knowing exactly where you need to go, what direction you need to go. No longer blocked. Yeah, you're going to be a little sad about what you had to cut off. But this is change. Point in that compass, it is time. Decluttering, getting rid of the nonsense, changes of seasons. It's your time. It's your time. Like you've just been kind of riding the wave, but you've gained the knowledge and the clarity. And I mean, that was fast clarity. Something that you've been like mulling over for a while. And like, it could even be today you were like, you know what? I need to, I need to worry about me. I feel this. I need to take action on the thing I've been wanting for a long time. Right. Seeing very clearly to this heartbreak, this deception. That's deception. That's hurt. That's pain. That's loss. Being ice to it now. Okay. Focusing very much on what you needed to release with this. It's kept you stuck. It's kept you sad. It's it's blocked you. It's it's literally blocked your intuition. It has blocked your path. You've been just riding along and now, now you know exactly who you need to clean out of your life and exactly where you need to go. All right, I'm gonna leave it at that. Please drop a comment and hit subscribe and I'll catch you later.